Twitch TV is your education station. An Indiana Congresswoman wants to require the federal government to make student financial aid applications available sooner. News 8's government reporter Garrett Berquist explains how this grew out of problems with the financial aid rollout earlier this year. When lawmakers revamped the Free Application for Federal Student Aid System, or FAFSA, they required applications to become available no later than January 1st and preferably by October 1st. Indiana Congresswoman Erin Houchin says that's too vague. This year's incoming college freshmen were the first to use a new, simplified FAFSA application. The new system was plagued by delays and technical problems that prevented many prospective students from applying in time. What the problems with it have, have led to is uh, delayed decisions for financial aid for students uh, and also for universities who have an uncertainty about what their enrollment numbers are going to look like. Houchin's bill would require the Department of Education to make the FAFSA application available no later than October 1st of the year before you start college. Louisiana Senator Bill Cassidy has a similar bill in the Senate. He uh, and I are working on this bill to uh, make sure that the Department of Education meets the October 1st deadline. And we're firm on that because students need this information and, and universities make, need this information to, to make decisions about where they're going to go to college. Houchin says under her bill, if Department of Education officials think they can't make that deadline, they would have to specifically ask Congress for more time. Right now, she says this is the primary legislative fix Congress wants to pursue. Her bill is already in committee where Democrats say it could cause department officials to rush and make even more mistakes. Removing flexibility could force the department to launch a broken, unworkable FAFSA on October 1st, even if the department knows that delaying it for a short period of time would provide the time to fix the known problems. The bill would only apply to future college applicants. Houchin says it's too late for her bill to help those still dealing with this year's FAFSA portal problems. Houchin says Secretary of Education Miguel Cardona has told her committee the department will make every effort to make this year's October 1st deadline. A Department of Education spokesperson says, our top priority remains delivering a better FAFSA and improved application experience for the next FAFSA cycle. To impose a legislative deadline without providing the additional resources or support needed to launch is simply a political stunt and will not actually help ahead of the 25-26 launch. Houchin says if you're still waiting to find out if your FAFSA application went through, you should contact your member of Congress for help. I'm Garrett Bergquist for Wish TV, wishtv.com, or follow us on Facebook for updates.